PEMS Analytics Europe at eHealth Week in Budapest. The Healthcare Information and Management Systems Society monitors the use of IT in healthcare and establishes comparability between different hospitals based on its own benchmark system. This is part of a worldwide strategy that HEMS has of collecting as much information as possible about IT adoption and use in healthcare settings worldwide. We have HEMS Analytics US, we have HEMS Analytics Asia, and HEMS Analytics Europe. In Europe, we're collecting data from 13 countries, and the objective here is to provide chief information officers, ministries of health, and other decision makers with as much information as possible about what technology is being used in healthcare settings and how that technology is being used. As a result of that, Hospitals will be able to function more efficiently. They'll be able to make better decisions about patient care. Doctors will have the right kinds of information tools about how their organization works and how they compare to other hospitals like them. The Electronic Medical Record EMR, adoption model was created to enable benchmarking and identification of best practices. The model identifies seven stages of progress in electronic medical record EMR capabilities, ranging from limited ancillary department systems through a paperless EMR environment. The EMR adoption model describes in seven generic stages um, a roadmap towards the implementation of a full-blown EMR. If you take a hospital that is still at the early stages, it provides them with a generic roadmap. If you take a hospital at the higher stages, it provides them with the opportunity to identify peers that are at the same level and that facilitates exchange. So if you have a stage six hospital and bring them together with another stage six hospital, both can exchange and work together on reaching the highest level, which is stage seven. Events such as the fully booked Leaders in Health IT Symposium at eHealth Week and Healthcare IT Leadership in Autumn allow CIOs to network and exchange. They provide an opportunity to learn about the implementation of eHealth solutions in best practices. One of the five key barriers that we um, hear when we uh, ask CIOs or decision makers about health IT, um, what keeps you away from implementing an EMR is we're too small, we're too specialized. That is not true. In actual fact, out of this so far seven stage six hospitals that we have identified, three are small and specialized with less than 400 beds. Hospitals which achieve stage six or seven receive an award. This year there were four, two Spanish hospitals, one Swedish, and for the first time, one German hospital. The Universitätsklinikum in Hamburg, Eppendorf, was recognized as one of only seven stage six hospitals in Europe to date. Receiving this external award represents a fantastic achievement after all the years of immense effort involved in converting a hospital from paper-based to electronic processes. The prize was awarded in recognition of the seamless integration of electronic patient records into the hospital's management processes. Processes throughout the hospital are now much more effective. We are now much quicker in every aspect of clinical data, which means, for example, that with a minimal growth in personnel of just 8%, we are still able to handle over 60% more patients with the same facilities. And the HIMSS Award motivates hospitals to continue to push hard to achieve their goals. CIO Tommaso Piazza of the Ismet Hospital in Palermo is a good example. Last year, he received the award for achieving Stage 6. Everybody was very happy about the prize and everybody was very happy about this type of recognition because uh, it's a recognition for IT, but it's a recognition for the entire organization who can reach this level. This is a boost to do better and try to reach the stage seven in the near future.